For many folks, a simple solution to their sleep woes is using an adjustable bed or pillow to elevate legs in bed. In this video, we'll talk about everything you need to know about elevating your legs while sleeping and six health benefits from this habit. Number six, helps improve blood circulation. Throughout the day, blood circulates through your veins, traveling away from and then back toward your heart. When you're laying down, however, your heart has to work even harder to move things along. The simple solution, raise your legs slightly and let gravity provide a boost. Raised leg poses have long been practiced in yoga as a way to get your blood flowing, and sleeping in this position can help you wake up feeling refreshed and revitalized. Number five, helps minimize pain and sciatica symptoms. As the body's longest nerve, the sciatic nerve can wreak havoc and pain when inflamed. This nerve follows the spinal cord down the back into the buttocks and then down both legs. When the sciatic nerve is irritated by compression or inflammation, it can cause lower back pain, leg pain, and even numbness in the legs and feet. To alleviate pain, the key is to reduce the pressure that the lumbar discs put on the root of the nerve and lying on your back with your feet elevated can do just that. Number 4. Lowers the risk of blood clots and DVT. When you're sedentary for a long time, especially after a major surgery, your risk of blood clots increases. Deep vein thrombosis DVT, can also occur, which is when a blood clot forms deep inside your veins usually in your body's lower extremities. This can lead to a life-threatening situation, so be sure to contact a medical professional for help. Once under the care of a doctor, you can help ease DVT by keeping your legs elevated to relieve pain, improve circulation, and reduce swelling. In addition to pain relief, sleeping with your knees up can also help to reduce swelling and keep the blood flowing. Number three, helps reduce varicose veins. While varicose veins aren't known to be a serious medical condition, they can definitely be uncomfortable. These enlarged veins are caused by an increase in blood pressure, signifying damaged or weakened valves, the parts of the veins responsible for pumping blood to and from your heart. Elevating your legs at the end of the day, combined with compression socks and lifestyle changes like losing weight, can help. Number 2. Alleviates Back Pain if you were taught to stand up straight as a kid, you might assume that your spine is completely straight. The truth is, your spine has a natural curve to it. Because of this, sleeping completely flat can add unnecessary pressure on your lower back. By elevating your legs slightly, or even better, getting into a zero-gravity position with your head and legs raised, your body will be in a more comfortable, natural position. The result? Deeper, higher quality sleep without any back pain. Number one, reduces strain on heart muscles. Elevating your legs while sleeping or incrementally throughout the day helps pull older deoxygenated blood towards the heart where the blood, to some extent, is cleaned and then released back into the bloodstream. While it may seem counterintuitive to think about this process, reducing strain on heart muscles, there is definitely science behind the claim. When blood is pulled towards the heart by means of elevated legs or otherwise, this is less work for the heart. Instead of the heart pumping harder to bring the blood back to it, gravity does much of the work. Less workload for the heart means less strain and improved cardiovascular function which is why science supports frequent leg elevation as one way to reduce strain on your heart and vascular system. How much should you elevate your legs? How much elevation is enough? Is there such a thing as too much elevation? The general guidance is elevating your legs to about six to 12 inches above your heart with a natural bend to your legs. Tips and tricks for elevating your legs. Raise your legs above your heart. This is the only way that elevating your legs will be effective. Elevate them at least three times a day. Doing this just once in a while isn't going to cut it. You're going to need to make this part of your regular daily routine in order to see some actual results. Keep them up for at least 15 minutes. The longer, the better. But if all you can squeeze in is 15 minutes three times a day, then do it. 
Ideally, you can do it while watching a show on television or while doing some work on your laptop. That way, you are killing two birds with one stone. Make sure to use a cushion. Whatever you do, do not elevate your legs on a table or a desk without using the cushion. If you are putting your legs right on the hard surface, then you run the risk of even more problems. You'll at least get some pain in your legs or bruises. So be sure to find a pillow or a cushion to pad your legs. Use the wall. There is also the option to use the wall to elevate your legs. Simply lie down on the floor and slide your behind all the way to the wall. Lay a pillow under your head, then raise your legs up and rest them against the wall, keeping them straight. This is a practice used often in yoga and is sworn by many yogis to be one of their favorite stretching exercises. Be sure to only remain in the pose only from 5 to 10 minutes so that no undue stress is put on your heels, knees, or spine. Thank you for watching guys. See you in the next video.